Hi everybody, it's the Butterfly Crafter. So yesterday I got a text message and it was from the eye doctors and they said that my glasses were ready. So now I have new glasses. So after I got done there, I figured, well, I'll go over to the Dollar Tree and see what they have. And what I was really looking for was the mini white Christmas trees. When I looked around the first time and I couldn't find them. So then I went back around and then I was talking to the manager and just so happened I had to look over and lo and behold, here's the Christmas trees. So I got six of these and I'm going to do a DIY and I'm going to show you what I'm going to make with these. So I got them all there and I'll just show you some other things I got. And these are ornament fillers and there's three ounces in here. And these are like a light blue color. So I got those. And then I got the last two packs of these are like like little beads. So I got those three. And then I got some zip ties because I need those for this project. And then sorry, I got everything all spread out here. I got some of the snowflakes, and there's 10 pieces in there. I got some of those. And then I found these, which is really pretty. So I grabbed two of these. I figured I might as well grab them while I can, because if you don't, you're never going to see them again. I thought those were really pretty. So yes, I have two of them. Of course, the glitter's coming all of them. So yes, be careful, because there is tons of glitter on here. I thought they were so pretty. So I got those two. And what else did I grab? Oh, and I just grabbed this little tiny backpack. I thought it was really cute. Well, that's what I got. So for my DIY, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a snowflake out of these Christmas trees. So I just basically just take everything out of the box and to pull off the bottom piece. And then what you do is you take two of them and you take some wire and you attach them together and you do it to all of them so I did the first two I got them all attached together so and then I got some wire I've had this so basically it's what I, I used on those two and it's holding them together pretty good so far so let's see where the end is I'll poke my finger so anyways just basically See if I can turn it down here just a little bit so you can see what I'm doing. Go for a little way. Okay. So basically you just take them and you set them like this. Once I can find out where the wire is here. The opening. Oh, I had it last night. Ah, there we go. So basically you take this and wrap it around here. A good twist. So I hope everybody's uh, doing okay. The weather's getting a little bit more chillier up here. It's getting colder. We're in the 40s right now. So yeah, I hate when it gets cold, but what are you gonna do? It's that time of the year. So now you just take this and you just wrap it around. And just keep going until you get it tight enough until it's stable so that's what you do and I will be back in a minute when I'm all done with this okay I'm back so now that it's all wired together lay it down and you take this one and put it like a cross and then you'll take this one and set it on top and get it right here so basically that's what it's supposed to look like you want to get it so it's all okay Get it like that. And get it up here. Lay it flat. 
so I can get it all crisscross. See here. I'm gonna make sure it's gonna lay right. So it looks like it's starting to form of a snowflake. But then I'll spread it all out and then it'll look better. So once you get that situated, you'll take it and you'll wrap more wire around it so that it's all connected together. And then use, see, so said use a little bit of hot glue. So, but I don't know how that's going to go. Well, this is going to be a, a little tough to try to wrap this around here. So, yeah, this is going to be a tough one. I'm trying to wrap wrap the wire around this with well, this thing because this isn't going to work out too well. I'm going to have to unravel this. Oh, let's see here. So anyways, I will uh, get this unraveled and then I will come back once it's all together and you can see what it looks like. So I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So we're going to see how this holds together here. I'm going to open this, start opening up these branches here. Let's see how this works. So try to turn it over. I'm going to use a pot glue here. See if that will help hold it together. E6000 glue on it. Let's see what happens. Just to get it so I can get it on. We'll see how that holds. Now, so I can get this on my old. Didn't work. Let that dry. This one's still loose. So yes, I was lucky to find these because this is what I really was kind of going up there for. I mean, I really wasn't going to go anywhere yesterday, but then when I got the text message saying my glasses were ready. Which I was shocked because they weren't supposed to be here until like the next week. But fine with me. I needed my new ones. So. Oh my goodness. Let's see how this turns out. I hope this turns out good. I always wanted to do this. Like the last one I had, I had used coat hangers. And it was so big, there was no place to put it. And then the lights started blowing out. So, it's time to make a new one. And I wasn't sure how I wanted to do it. And I was like, I really don't want to buy all these coat hangers. So then, I seen, I've seen it on YouTube before, people making these. So, I decided to give it a try and see how it works. If it works, great. I don't well then it's a big old flop but I think it'll work let's see is this dry yet so I can turn this over because this will be the back side so all this stuff is showing anyways on the back I don't want to turn it over if it's not dry. Okay, it's dry. Okay, let's flip it over. Ah, that's showing too. It looks like I'm going to have to put a bow or something in the middle here. But basically all the branches are up this way anyways. This is the 
top of them. Okay, while I'm doing that, I'll be right back. Okay, so that's what it looks like so far. But I don't want to put the lights on because I want to wait until I get some white zip ties to match in. I don't want the red ones on here. It's just going to show through. So, But anyways, once I get the lights on, I will show you what it's going to look like. But let me know if you think it's going to look like a snowflake. So, but basically, yeah. So it takes six of these Christmas trees. So if you want to run to the Dollar Tree and you can find them, there's a decoration for you. So I managed to cover up the middle. I just took some branches and kind of bent them in so you couldn't see the middle. So once I can figure out how to make a bow, I'll put a bow in the middle of here. So, but anyways, that is my DIY project. I'm going to still fix this and mangle with it and yeah and just kind of straighten it out so it looks a little bit more like a snowflake it does kind of look like as long as you got the points here and points out so yeah definitely but anyways i just wanted to come and show you that so we still have a video for this week but anyways i hope everybody has a good evening and i will i'll talk to you later bye for now